Welcome back everyone. This is a little bit of a different video than I usually do, but I wanted to kind of showcase this cool pack I found. And Kay is actually a very cool artist who does a bunch of packs and, and he has a few other things that you should definitely check out. But I kind of wanted to just showcase this one remastered dungeon pack that he just made. So let's head over to the project and let's take a look. So here you can see we have I have a very simple scene. I've just set up a few different grid maps to actually add the a few objects and flooring and everything. Here I have the world environment so it doesn't look too ugly and dark. Directional light and we have a floor so that it actually collides with everything. And then we just have a really simple player that moves around and a camera that's like not very good but it works well enough. So let's take a look. So here you can see that our pack kind of works and we can actually move around and look. So it's actually really cool. So we have the coins and barrels and stuff. So it's a really cool pack that you should definitely check out. I really like it. It's really like cutesy. So it's you can do a lot with this pack. It's really cool. So I definitely recommend you check it out. Um, it's really, really cool. And I don't know, go check out his uh, itch. I'll put the link in the description down below. This is the pack that I used. Um, you can see here, that's oh, the same link. And uh, you can see here, he has a bunch of other packs as well. He has the old one. So this one was the old one, I assume, and he remastered it, so he remade it. Um, I think you can buy it, so let's actually take a look in a second. But there's also a character pack, which is really cool. It has a few different characters, and he has the animations for it, so you don't have to animate anything. So it's actually really neat. And there's also a medieval pack, a spooky thingy majiggy, and a mini game variety pack. So I think you can pay up to $8 for all of it. I think $12 for the source files if you want the Blender files. Um, and, but you can get a good amount of it for free. So that's what I did. I, I got like 200 asset packs for free just to show you guys. It's a really cool pack that you should definitely check out. Um, if you guys wanna see how I did this, I might make a video on it later on, but it's fairly really simple. I just got the GLTF files and I just put them in. And here we can see the library. I can show you maybe how to set up the library another video, but um, it's really simple. You just set up a bunch of tiles and then go to scene, export as mesh library. We have the library here. And then in the actual grid map, we can just take the library and drag it in. And that's how you kind of get the uh, tiles like that. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys use this pack. It's a really cool ha pack that you should check out. And I will see you guys next time. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that sub button down below as I'm always creating new videos and trolls for you guys. And of course, if you have any recommendations, leave a comment down below. Or if you guys want, you can make sure that your voice is heard. Definitely check out my socials down below. I have a Discord that's always growing and I would love to be able to chat with you guys and see what's going on in your own lives. I have a few other links down below that you should check out. My Steam page, my Patreon, if you wanna check that out. And of course, my Twitch. Um, I, I kind of stream every now and then. But it's hard. I hope to see you guys around. Till next time. Bye-bye.